Hello, World in Days viewers. Get ready to embark on a mesmerizing five-day journey with us through Dubai, a city where ancient dunes meet futuristic skyscrapers. In this series, we'll uncover the best of Dubai's culture, architecture, and culinary delights. From the opulence of towering landmarks to the charm of historic souks, we invite you to join us on this extraordinary exploration. So, let's unveil the secrets of this Arabian treasure together on World in Days. Our adventure begins in downtown Dubai, a showcase of the city's transformation into a global icon of luxury and innovation. Here, the past and future are woven into the fabric of the cityscape offering a glimpse into the ambitious spirit of Dubai. The journey in Dubai begins with the awe-inspiring Burj Khalifa, a landmark that has defined the city's skyline. Standing at a staggering height of 828 meters, it's not just the world's tallest building, but a marvel of engineering and design. The tower's sleek, elongated structure is inspired by the desert flower, Hymenocallis, and incorporates elements of traditional Islamic architecture. A visit to its observation decks, at the top, located on the 124th and 148th floors, offers an unparalleled view of Dubai's urban tapestry and the desert beyond. The high-speed elevators, equipped with multimedia presentations, make the journey as thrilling as the destination. At night, the Burj Khalifa's LED light shows are a spectacle, illuminating the city with vibrant colors and patterns. For a quick yet delightful lunch, we visit the cafe in the Burj Khalifa. It's a perfect spot to enjoy a selection of gourmet dishes that showcase the fusion of Emirati and global flavors, all within the world's tallest building. Adjacent to the Burj Khalifa is the Dubai Mall, one of the largest shopping malls in the world. This sprawling complex is much more than a retail destination. It's an entertainment hub for all ages. The Dubai Mall is home to the Dubai Aquarium and Underwater Zoo, where visitors can marvel at thousands of aquatic animals, including sharks and rays, in one of the world's largest suspended tanks. For children, the mall offers Kidzania, an interactive mini-city where they can role-play various professions. Its fast ice rink caters to both beginners and seasoned skaters, providing a cool respite from the desert heat. Art enthusiasts can appreciate the displays at the Dubai Mall's Art Zone, which showcases works from local and international artists. And when it comes to dining, the choices are as diverse as the global brands it houses ranging from gourmet restaurants to popular fast food joints. Our day culminates with dinner at Omani, where we'll indulge in contemporary Indian cuisine. The restaurant, with its elegant ambience and stunning views, provides the perfect backdrop to reflect on our day's experiences. As the day winds down, we take a leisurely evening stroll around downtown Dubai, absorbing the vibrant energy and dazzling lights of the city. This moment of tranquility allows us to reflect on the day's adventures and anticipate the exciting journey ahead. On day two, we step back in time in old Dubai, a district where the city's rich history and heritage come alive and then delve into the glittering world of the gold souk. We begin in the al Fahidi historical neighborhood, with its winding lanes and traditional wind tower houses. Located along Dubai Creek, al Fahidi historical neighborhood, also known as al Bastakia, is a portal into Dubai's past. This preserved area dates back to the early 20th century and stands in stark contrast to the city's modern architecture. The neighborhood is characterized by its traditional wind towers, which were an early form of air conditioning, 
designed to channel cool breezes into the houses. A visit to Al Fahidi historical neighborhood is not just a step back in time, but also an educational journey, offering a deeper understanding of Dubai's roots and the lifestyle of its early inhabitants. For lunch, we stop at the Arabian Tea House, a hidden gem nestled in the heart of Al Fahidi. This charming spot offers traditional Emirati dishes in a serene, historic setting, surrounded by the echoes of history. Next, we visit the Dubai Museum, located in the Al Fahidi Fort, to delve deeper into Dubai's heritage. Then, we take a traditional Abra ride across Dubai Creek, witnessing the bustling activity of this historic waterway, a lifeline of the city's trade and commerce. In the afternoon, we explore the famous Gold Souk, a traditional market that has been the heart of Dubai's gold trade for decades. The Souk's labyrinth of shops glittering with gold, Diamonds and precious stones offers a glimpse into Dubai's rich trading history and the city's enduring love affair with gold. Next, we dine at the charming Beit Al Waqil, a gem in historic Bur Dubai, offering an authentic taste of Emirati cuisine right on the serene Dubai Creek. Located along the Dubai Creek, we end our day at Festival City. It is known for its shopping, dining, and entertainment options. One of the highlights here is the Imagine Show, a free-to-attend visual spectacle all set against the backdrop of the Dubai skyline. Festival City is also a great place to enjoy a meal, with a variety of restaurants offering scenic views of the creek and city. On third day, we explore the luxurious Jumeirah district and the stunning Dubai Marina, where modernity and leisure blend seamlessly. Our day begins at the Jumeirah Mosque, an architectural masterpiece and one of the most photographed sites in Dubai. This mosque, built entirely from white stone in the medieval Fatimid tradition, reflects an artistic vision that combines both modernity and ancient Islamic architecture. It looks stunning at sunrise and sunset, when the natural light casts a warm glow on its façade. Lunch is at the Lime Tree Cafe, a cozy spot known for its fresh, wholesome food. Here, we'll enjoy a relaxed meal in a contemporary setting, a contrast to the historical atmosphere of Jumeirah Mosque. In the afternoon, we visit the bustling Dubai Marina, a man-made canal city framed by a two-mile-long waterfront walkway. Here, we're surrounded by impressive skyscrapers and luxury yachts, a testament to Dubai's contemporary urban landscape. Just a stone's throw away is Jumeirah Beach, with its white sands and crystal clear waters offering a refreshing retreat. The beachfront also offers a spectacular view of the iconic Burj Al Arab, providing a perfect backdrop for those memorable holiday photos. Dinner at Pier 7 presents a culinary journey through various cuisines, each floor of this tower offering a different dining experience. As we dine, we're treated to spectacular views of the marina, a perfect end to a day of luxury and relaxation. To end our day, we take a stroll along the marina walk, an ideal place to experience the lively nightlife of Dubai Marina. This walk allows us to absorb the vibrant energy of the area and contemplate the contrasting facets of Dubai we've experienced with World in Days. On day four, we escape the city's hustle and immerse ourselves in the mystique of the Arabian desert, experiencing traditional Bedouin culture and the natural beauty of the dunes. Our day begins with an exciting desert safari. 
an essential Dubai experience. We embark on a thrilling dune-bashing adventure in 4x4 vehicles, racing up and down the rolling sand dunes. For those seeking a more traditional experience, camel rides offer a serene way to explore the desert landscape. The safari also provides opportunities for sandboarding, a fun activity where you can glide down dunes on specially designed boards. For lunch, we enjoy a traditional meal at a desert safari camp, savoring local delicacies amidst the dunes. This rustic dining experience, set in the heart of the desert, provides a unique taste of Bedouin hospitality. As the sun begins to set, painting the desert sky in hues of orange and pink, the camp comes alive with a variety of cultural activities. The highlight of the evening is a series of performances, including the mesmerizing Tanura dance, a traditional Egyptian folk dance, and a captivating belly dance show under the stars. Dinner is a lavish barbecue buffet, featuring an assortment of grilled meats, fresh salads, and local delicacies, accompanied by aromatic Arabic coffee and dates. We conclude our day by spending the night in a desert camp, sleeping under the stolid sky. This peaceful and reflective moment allows us to appreciate the desert's timeless beauty and ponder the diverse experiences we've shared on World in Days. On our final day with World in Days, we explore the man-made marvel of Palm Jumeirah and the splendor of Atlantis, the palm, witnessing the pinnacle of luxury and human ingenuity in Dubai. We start our final day at Palm Jumeirah, a feat of engineering and a symbol of Dubai's luxury and ambition. This man-made island, shaped like a palm tree, is one of the largest artificial islands in the world and a pinnacle of urban planning and design. As we tour around Palm Jumeirah, we are greeted with stunning views of the Dubai coastline and the Arabian Gulf. The island is a hub of upscale living, featuring posh hotels, exclusive beachfront villas, and chic apartments. A key highlight is the Palm Jumeirah Boardwalk, stretching along the crescent of the island, offering spectacular views and a variety of dining options. The island is also home to some of Dubai's most luxurious spas and beach clubs, providing a serene and exclusive retreat. For breakfast, we visit Gordon Ramsay's Bread Street Kitchen at Atlantis, the Palm. This dining experience combines a relaxed atmosphere with a menu of British and European dishes, providing a perfect start to our day. Next, we explore Atlantis, the Palm, a majestic hotel situated at the apex of the Palm Jumeirah. This iconic resort is known for its opulent architecture, inspired by the myth of Atlantis, and its unique marine habitats. The Lost Chambers Aquarium, part of the hotel, offers an incredible journey through underwater mazes and tunnels, providing a close look at the ruins of the lost city of Atlantis and its marine inhabitants. Adjacent to the Atlantis is the Aquaventure Water Park, one of Dubai's most exciting attractions. This award-winning water park features a variety of thrilling slides, river rapids, and splash areas. The Leap of Faith slide, plunging the rider into a tube that runs through a shark-filled lagoon, is a favorite for thrill-seekers. For those looking for a more relaxed experience, the lazy river and the private beach offer a perfect way to unwind. The water park also offers interactive experiences, such as swimming with dolphins and sea lions, which are perfect for families and children. As we spend our day at Atlantis, the Palm, we are not just enjoying its world-class amenities, but also witnessing a masterpiece of modern architectural and engineering prowess. Dinner is at Oceano, a fine dining experience offering stunning underwater views. This restaurant, 
known for its exquisite seafood and elegant ambience, allows us to reflect on the luxurious aspects of Dubai's lifestyle. As we conclude our journey, we take a farewell stroll along the Palm Jumeirah boardwalk, enjoying the serene views of the Arabian Gulf. This moment of reflection gives us a chance to reminisce about our incredible five-day adventure with World in Days in Dubai. Adding an extra day to the itinerary allows us to include Global Village, a seasonal cultural extravaganza that showcases pavilions from different countries. Global Village is a unique cultural and entertainment destination that brings together the best of international cuisine, entertainment, and shopping. Each season, over 75 countries are represented in around 30-plus pavilions, each designed to reflect the country's unique culture, architecture, and style. It's like traveling the world without leaving Dubai. The destination also features thrilling rides and attractions for all ages, performances, and a variety of dining options. It's a wonderful place to experience the diverse cultural fabric of Dubai in one location. Keep in mind that Global Village is a seasonal event, usually running from November to April. The ideal time to visit Dubai largely depends on your interests and preferences. During spring season, temperatures are comfortable, ideal for exploring and sightseeing. Dubai comes alive with outdoor activities, and it's a great time to experience the desert in full bloom. The Dubai Food Festival in March is a culinary highlight. If you can handle the heat and don't mind indoor activities, summer in Dubai offers some packs. Malls and indoor attractions are less crowded, and hotels often provide attractive deals. However, outdoor activities are limited due to the high temperatures. Autumn sees a drop in temperature, making it pleasant for exploring the city. This period is quieter in terms of tourism, so you can enjoy less crowded attractions. The Dubai Fitness Challenge in October is a great event for sports enthusiasts. Winter is the peak tourist season in Dubai, thanks to its mild and pleasant climate. This is the best time for outdoor activities, desert safaris, and beach visits. The Dubai Shopping Festival in January and February is a major attraction, offering entertainment and shopping deals. Additionally, the city celebrates various cultural and national events during this season. Dubai's event calendar is packed throughout the year, with various festivals, sports events, and cultural activities. No matter when you visit, there's always something exciting happening in this dynamic city. Remember, each season in Dubai offers unique experiences, so consider what you want to do and see to choose the best time for your visit. Dubai's climate can be quite hot, especially if you are not used to desert temperatures. Always carry water with you. Respect local culture by dressing modestly, especially when visiting religious sites like the Jumeirah Mosque. Schedule outdoor activities either early in the morning or later in the afternoon to avoid the midday sun. Dubai's public transport system, including its metro, is efficient and can help you avoid traffic congestion. For popular attractions like the Burj Khalifa and the Desert Safari, it's best to book your tickets in advance to avoid disappointment. Don't miss out on traditional Emirati dishes and the diverse culinary offerings in Dubai. Respect local customs and traditions, especially during religious months like Ramadan. While most places accept cards, having cash is handy in traditional markets like the Gold Souk. And there you have it, our incredible five-day journey through the vibrant and diverse city of Dubai. From the towering heights of the Burj Khalifa to the historical depths of old Dubai, 
we've experienced a world where tradition meets modernity in a truly unique way. We hope this journey with World in Days has inspired you to explore the wonders of Dubai for yourself. As we conclude this series, we'd like to thank you for joining us on this adventure. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to World in Days for more exciting travel content. Stay tuned for our next destination. And until then, keep exploring and discovering the world, one day at a time. Safe travels and see you soon.